Hello YouTubers, how are you? We got another tutorial how to mount yourself a fast wireless charging for your car. In our case, we have an Audi A8 and uh, you know from 2008 there weren't wireless chargers inside. I think they come uh, in 2014-15, something like this. But let's mount a wireless charger discreet and minimize the cables around the dashboard as much as possible because you know the wires are not aesthetically correct so guys you will need a wireless charger a wire usb and most thin wire you can find a 2.1 amps charger and i recommend you to change the standard cigarette lighter into this one it's a port with 5 volts 2.1 amps and 1 amp and i already did some modification it depends from car to car and through this usb it will feed up I tried to find the slimmest USB. It's hard to film with one hand and with the other to do this. And I found a thin USB that I put it from here to get this ashtray closed. So it has two positions. One is closed, one is open. And now the wires are discreet put under the dashboard. So here's what we're going to do. Because you know Audi A8 has all the sockets let me film this it has all the sockets active so this is another problem because if you want to use a wireless charger well when uh, the car will be locked the um, this port will consume 0, 0, 3 amps so it's not good you have a power consumption static power consumption of course you know in this uh, car we have the solar sun hood our subscribers know it's already this we have the power sun hood that um, charges the internal battery while it's sunny or not necessarily sunny when in the cloud with the solar energy but this is not enough and i want a good way to conserve the battery so this relays 12 volts at 10 amps it's enough because the wireless charger uh, consumes 2 amps so this relay will uh, fit up the wireless charger only when you unlock your car so for this operation guys i'm not going to show you you got to go to an uh, electrician uh, to make you this uh, this job use fuses they, that person responsible will know what to do to be safe your car to be safe from the point of view of uh, wire management electrical wire management we got some internal lighting to the ashtray i want to keep this we got some special connectors you see i will uh, make these connections we will isolate everything and we will hope to have a decent wireless charging in the car so guys, let me tell you what I have done. Now, we have here the main wire with 12 volts. We have the connectors inside this uh, USB. All the wires are isolated with safety. And we have the relay. Now guys, I mounted everything. And um, it remains this wire here that I will try to mask it somehow here. To be barely visible but the important thing is this one when i unlock the car i unlocked it okay it will automatically turn on the wireless charging and when i close the car when i will close the car let's see the socket it's off and look guys let's turn it back again on look how nice it looks this grid i have to say it's elegant and now we got to mount the ashtray that is also illuminated so this wire is not exactly what i wanted but i will try to do something maybe i will get a connector in l shape and uh, it would be good so let's open up the car the wireless started wireless charging started and now let's put a phone and hooray we have a success the phone is charging it's staying stable but um it's a circle in the pack that will permit to stick really good to this wireless charging not to fall off when driving this is it's stickable but it will uh, in corners the phone uh, will drop so you got to use that that uh, metal circle if you want to see this charger guys 
we have it in uh, our videos. Now guys, the wireless charging looks like this. And it's on the original support fitted into this car. I don't like this micro USB connector. I uh, bought a 90 degrees. I will mount a 90 degrees to keep it not so visible like this one. But um, when you go in your car, you mount your phone like this, you can tilt it in the position, uh, pan tilt it as you want. This is the good thing. I don't like this uh, glass screen protectors because I have problem with the finger pin. So I made a, a setting to unblock the phone when it senses uh, the ODA8 uh, Bluetooth and to keep the screen unlocked but i think in the landscape position it will not unblock only in the portrait position uh, it unlocks so now the multimedia device is connected by bluetooth uh, the streaming is made in the car's uh, bluetooth management so let's put some music and uh, i want you to see that uh, i can let's see let's play it I can use the commands for pause. If I'm pushing uh, one time the volume, it's paused one time. And two times it resumes the music. And now, if I want to switch the tracks, I use the car's original navigations from the steering wheel even, or from uh, the main console. And this is really good, I can uh, switch between tracks. Now, if I want to go in ways, this is the main purpose I uh, was mounting this wireless charging. To make it ergonomical, my hand to be exactly on the rest support and on the shift knob and to control with a finger the phone. Uh, it's a little bit, it's not sensitive, this touch of the screen is not that sensitive because of the glass protector. You know, these glass protectors have problems, but I, I'm happy and um, I uh, fitted best a screen protector. I break three or four until I uh, succeed to manage uh, to fit perfectly without any dust underneath. Beside ways, guys, uh, we can play easily. We can play YouTube and we can use all the functions like uh, like i made an android device but controlled by this keyboard so i will disable this keyboard to control over the let's see the media the source and the external device too i put an android system here is now is disabled i will not use it anymore because i believe that uh, this is more practical way practical than uh, then this system and uh, uh, you got to believe this uh, screen uh, of 6.2 I think in the S10 plus it's more good than this 18 by 480 resolution screen so not even it's uh, it charges my phone I can see in ways uh, some navigation if I will not use the original navigation for example you know ways has uh, uh, the accidents on the road the police uh, the all kinds of stuff uh, that uh, will help you all kinds of informations so I can use all the features of the phone I have uh, in the front of me I, I can see way the the street and the everything it's a little bit down from the original navigation but this is not the point um, it's close to the navigation you have uh, a field of view to pretty good for safe driving and uh, guys I like how I did the uh, how I did this. It was another possibility to put the phone here, but uh, you cannot use it. I used the original phone from the from the steering wheel to be 100% safe when I'm driving, and uh, this is very good. So in this multimedia, I think will be best. Uh, you can control it by, uh, as I as I told you before, with the car's uh, original. Uh, uh console or the steering wheel so guys i hope you like this video i hope you like uh, how i made this wireless charger and i can give you an idea as for those uh, users who have uh, an audi 8 d3 i think in d4 in uh, 2015 
you can find uh, already the wireless charging I'm also considering on uh, to buy an Audi AA 2016 so thank you for watching guys if you think this idea is good please thumbs up and uh, subscribe to this channel because we have crazy ideas and good practical ideas have a great day see you guys bye